What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Okay, people. You heard the intro. You see the face. So you have to know the Swagger 3.0 Reloader is in the building, so let's get this little charade over. Today we'll talk about black people, my favorite subject. And I see, I saw a lot of interviews, I see, I read the paper, and here's what kills me. Black folks vote for everybody else's right but their own. I mean, the coonery and buffoonery of black people voting for it, and yes, I'm talking about it again, so please get over it, because it's really happening and it's going on right now. Black people will vote for homosexual rights, yet at the same time, they ignore their own rights being taken away, or they're, you know, because of the, the Section 8, no, Section 4 and 5 of the Civil Rights Voting Act. Well, they didn't protest, none of that. And then what happened was, I made a video about it earlier. I talked about what other other people who look like me, and I'm not, and like, most of the people just don't care. And that's the shame, because they want to cry and bitch and moan, but when they, when they have time to really they can affect it, it's like, I don't care about that. This then what affects them is, well, that's not right. They're the first ones in line, you know what I mean? They're the first ones waving the flag and shit, but when it's time to do something, they don't be like, nah, that's all right. No, this isn't a coincidence. Minority groups have questionable agendas. And when they do, they come to the black community because they always get the automatic cosign from Sharpton and Jackson. Jackson and Sharpton will, will lead motherfuckers to hell and y'all think it's cool. I don't know why. I don't know how that happened all of a sudden. But you know how y'all do. You know, and what happens is in return, because we're the only block that doesn't do this. Like, see, it's like working with groups, it's a barter system. You give us something, we give you something. But not with these, but with the black community. Whenever we were fighting for homosexual rights, you did not see any homosexuals out in the open, <laughs> not being funny. You did not see them out in the open going to bat for your civil rights. Is that a coincidence? No, it's called poor fucking dealing. It's called y'all couldn't, y'all y'all make the bad fucking, it's like, it's like this. If I'm going to give my money to somebody who makes my investment, if I'm going to keep giving my money, my money to a person who keeps losing me fucking 40% on my investments throughout the year, if I, if I keep giving that motherfucking money, I'm stupid for doing that. He's smart for doing because I know he's pocketing the money. But that's the analogy I'm using with the black community. You make these deals with all these other groups and you don't get nothing in return. And then at the time you want to say, well, where's everybody at? Meanwhile, they're like, we don't know what you're talking about. You don't hold nobody's feet to the fire. So that way I'm going to hold your foot to the fire. You need to make better deals. And like some, some of you are sit, need to sit down, honestly, because you're not helping the community. You're hurting the community. All your big talk and all your loud talk, it's, it's where's it getting you? Nowhere. You know, even though there's groups that like are against the against the same that they may have maybe against the same thing you were against or they're against, you still need to sit down and do the background research. It's not doing the background research, that's what's killing us. That's why whenever people my foreign friends say ask me, well, how come this, that, and the fifth? I'm sick of justifying the work that you got, the, not the work, the body of work that you guys have, because I'm like, well, bad policies, bad decisions, I said bad up top management, and like, now that some of us are just have a voice and can project that voice, a lot of you no good sambos want us to quell our voice. Well, there's only, you can't, well, you, even if I died, not which I don't hope I do, you know, but I know some of y'all do, but that's not a video for another day. Even if I died, this videos on YouTube, they live on forever. So hopefully I mean, there's more voices like myself out there that are finally speaking up against the cooning buffoonery. That's like, that's like, let me explain something. Your black congressional caucus, what do they do but eat fried chicken and eat watermelon? What do they do for you guys? Ask, ask me that. They should have been on the bandwagon of, well, if we vote for these rights. What are we getting? What does your black congressional caucus do? You know what they do? They do as much as they, you know, they, this does more, this does more 
the for me than the Black Congressional Caucus. You know why? I can drink water and get replenished. If I listen to Black Congressional Caucus, I can listen to bullshit and smell it. And then the Black Congressional Caucus meets with Obama. Like, you know, get the fuck out of here. What you need to do, you vote for who you want to vote for. Because at the end, all politicians are the same way, no matter if they're white, black, Hispanic, gay, green, or gold. They're the same. This it's, it's These liberals put these little labels on, and here come black folks running. Oh, that's what liberals said. Let's run to them. It's, it's what's going down. But, you know what I'm saying? If you don't wise up, don't cry when the shit hits the fan. That's all I'm saying now. Because this is when I do videos like this, when I actually think about it, it fucking disgust me. That a lot of you are happy living pigs and filth are living like this. And if it makes you happy, then don't cry because some of us want better things out of life. Some of us don't want to sit around with a welfare check and drink a 40 or drink Mad Dog 2020 all day. Some of us actually want a life. So don't hate us for wanting a life. So... I gotta go. I got shit to do with people to see and, and women to... Mm. Peace.